it. Oh my God. Yay. Oh my God. I've always wanted one of these, you guys. Guys, look. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Fly With Shelly. I've got a really fun project today. Um, I received in the mail, you guys, Vinny Collections, which consists of umbrellas, patio furniture. Uh, I just received this in the mail, got it on Amazon, came pretty quickly. Now I'm really excited to put all of this together, you guys. Uh, it is a 10 feet cantilever umbrella weight base, Vinny Collection, uh, which I'm really excited about. They are a wonderful company. If you guys wanna check them out, they're awesome. I'm gonna leave all of their information in the description box below. Make sure you click and check out their collection. Again, I got this on Amazon. So make sure that you check out their collection, you guys. I will put their website down below as well. Uh, like I said, they ship really quickly and their stuff is beautiful. So as you all know, if you wanna do a quick look in the back, we've done the gazebo not too long ago, um, which now needs a little bit of cleanup because the winter was a little rough. We had a lot of winds and bad weather. The ways is that we made, um, yeah, pretty, pretty cool. Um, now I cannot wait to add this patio set right here. It's hitting right now. Uh, we're looking at a probably a sunset in about an hour so we've got an hour to put this together so we'll calculate how long it takes us to do this and then i'll show you that in no time we'll have a beautiful area to relax maybe have a coffee a little cookie biscotti <laughs> and enjoy our biscotti under our little umbrella all right so let's get started all right you guys so it comes in a long box and then you will get another box you open and so here's the base you guys it's not too too heavy um and then i cannot wait to get the to the umbrella so all right let's unbox this all right so we got an instructions in the box and we've got four pieces that we're going to put together it seems very simple i'm still not sure what this is for but we will find out so uh, my daughter and i who just turned eight years old <laughs> she is about to help me out and we're going to figure this out and make it look out pretty all right let's get to it I think we figured out what the key is for. So the key is to remove every single little screw. Let's get the other part, another okay. part. So it's pretty easy. Look at the instruction, you guys. Very simple, very easy to read. Um, it tells you, there you go. So remember how that key was in there? We weren't sure what that was for. So you could undo the, these little screws. Um, and once they, and they come undone really quickly. So we're gonna do that to every single one in the next few minutes. All right, you guys, so we've piled them up so you can get a better idea. So these holes are for you to either put water in or sand. So we chose water. We're gonna go ahead and, go ahead and fill them up. As it says here, you can either pour water or sand to, to achieve the maximum weight. Um, and it says to use wet sand, obviously, because that will put a lot more weight to it. So we're gonna go ahead and go and put water in it and come right back. Guys, so we got it open and now we cannot wait to see the beautiful umbrella. It is wrapped very, very well. You've got the protective tape. You've got some cushioning there um, and they made sure to wrap the base here. We got some instructions to read. So we're gonna put all of this, uh, we're gonna take it out of the box and uh, we'll check it back in a second. Hey guys, so we opened one of the container and in one of the container, we got these two pieces here. Um, my guess is that's one of the base. This is obviously the base. Um, and then it comes here with a little, the instruction book and inside I found these little guys, which were well identifiable because they were kind of sticking out from this packet here. So you can't miss them. Um, all right, so let's open. Oh, this is the cutest thing you guys. Like they even took the time to put a thank you on there. Um, beautiful look at that that is this i know it is so sweet i mean people that take the time to do this vinnie collections are the best you guys um let's see. appreciate your interest and the reminder um you know they are awesome this is absolutely stunning and beautiful thank you so much for taking the time to say thank you a lot of vendors don't i really appreciate um vinnie for going out of his way to do so. Um, now we're gonna go ahead and look at the instruction again. Very simple. Okay. 
Okay, then part list, this is what we got. Uh, we got those parts as well. All right, they seem very simple, so we're gonna start in building those together. Okay, like the instruction says, you put these two parts and you make a cross, which we just did. It was very easy, just put one into the other. Uh, so, now as the instruction says, you wanna go ahead and put the screws in the base. Um, and then use these little the little key uh, which was provided so that's pretty simple we're gonna go ahead and do that with this big pole so let's go and do that all right I just put the pole right here making sure that the holes are aligned I've got the little kit I uh, got all of the screws out here and I'm gonna go ahead and start screwing them in there you go I'm gonna put this here you guys, it's pretty, it's very easy. There's nothing complicated, very easy to do. I'm doing it with one hand when I'm filming, and if I could do this, you guys can do this. It's very easy to put together. I'm gonna go and screw them in as soon as I am done here. My kids are taking care of filling every single one of them over there. You can see them posing, um, putting water in the base so that we can start enjoying our umbrella and We've had really bad winds lately, so we are making sure that um, the base stays solid. And so here you go. I'm going to go and screw them in, and then I'll get back to you guys in a bit. All right, you guys, that was really, really easy to do. I found the cap. I had a hard time finding it. It was actually in one of these little guys hiding. So now that I found it, it says that you need to put the cap right here in the top. So I will go ahead and do that. I believe it has to be, so the hole with the hole right there. So I guess I have to line them, the hole with the hole. Well, there's a big one here. I'm guessing it's for this. Yeah, yeah, that's about right. Okay. All right, you guys, so that looks perfect to me. Now I've, I've taken the plastic out of the umbrella. Let's see what is next. We're gonna go number three. It says that we have to put this little piece and click it together. That should be simple. I see what they're talking about here. And I see these little pins with the hole. So let's put those together and click it. All right. Okay. Righty, you guys. So I just clicked that in there. That was fairly easy. I made sure to pull that um, rope because it was kind of like stuck in there. So I pulled that. Next, we got to do the locking mechanism. So we're going to have to lock um, that in there. Make sure the two knobs and the crank are on the same side. Okay, we'll try it. If you need a weight base, please visit our Amazon store. But it came with my weight base, which is wonderful. Um, or I believe I purchased it separately. I can't remember. But uh, I did receive both. And they are on number three. So they filled these two already. Um, now there's this one missing. And they're working on the third one right now. So we're going to go ahead and lock it in and then we should have an umbrella as soon as i get back all right i'm excited so let's get this baby connected to the base all right you guys so i made sure to untie these guys so that it would smoothly go into its base here on each side when it did fall into that little area I'm gonna go ahead and tighten it up so um, but at, at the beginning it just wouldn't go you have to loosen it up um, just a little FYI and once you do and it falls into place then you can tighten it up really well all right um, so so far this is what it looks like I'm so excited it is looking nice because it is coming together all right now number five it says that you need to lift the lever I guess what lever are they talking about? This is the one. Okay, so we have to lift it up. Woo! Gosh. <laughs> I got so scared. Okay, so you lift it up. Gosh, I got so scared. Uh, lock it in place. Okay, so you lock it in place. So once you open it, um, you can lock it in place and then you have to put, bring it down. Okay, we'll go ahead and do that. But you guys, so I had it up. As you can see, it got... It surprised me I wasn't expecting it um, then I was able to kind of move this up and then I had to adjust this little guy and slide it all the way down so he would just keep it up uh, so this is what it looks so far I'm gonna take a little 
I step back. So as you can see, the umbrella is almost ready. I can't believe I did this all by myself. If I can do it, you guys, you can do it too. I'm gonna remove the plastic here. Um, it's obviously unstable at this point, a little bit, well, a lot. So we're almost done. Kids have done three of them. Uh, we're almost done with the last one. Uh, so now that we've locked it in place, again, make sure that you put this little piece and you slide it, which is this one right here. And it does say, do not just fold it down suddenly or the plastic will be easily broken. So make sure that you don't just bring it down. You have to make sure it's all the way up parallel and you could just slide it in and it'll lock it in with the lever. All right, now we're gonna go to setting. Uh, okay, um, oh, so now we're gonna open it. So it's telling you to turn it slowly for it to open. And then, optional, bind and secure the canopy with the pull to release, to reduce a potential sway and windy condition. Okay, um, so we're gonna go and start with opening it up now. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna put my feet down. Um, now we're gonna slowly open this up. Oh, it's so cute. Look at that. Oh my God. Yay. Oh my God. I've always wanted one of these, you guys. Guys, look. <laughs> this is so beautiful. I love it. Okay, I'm excited now. Like, let's go. This sun is killer. And I know my pool needs to be clean. Gosh, um, the weather's been so bad. Look at this, you guys. Like, seriously. If you don't think this is beautiful, I don't know what else. Like, this is gonna add shade. It's gonna complete my oasis, which I'm really, really, really excited because at night we have this beautiful fireplace with the blankets, um, the projector, um, our movie that plays over there. And now we have this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful patio, which complements our gazebo. So, and we have our fireplace. Um, this is gonna be so nice. I am so, so, so excited uh, for this project. So, all right, what's next? To tilt the umbrella. So again, you do the reverse, right? You lift this up and then you bring that down slowly and then um, move this part upward, obviously first, and then you bring it down. So that was, you can do a, a tilt for desired angles. Okay, so do not tilt it completely. And to close the umbrella, we do the reverse of what we did, which is wonderful, so. All right, you guys. Oh, we still have to put the base. That's right. We need to find a spot as to where we want this umbrella. Um, so I'm gonna start putting them in actually. And they are, wow, they're heavy. Wow. Yeah, this canopy is not going anywhere anytime soon. Yeah, this is super heavy. And I have a feeling that this hole goes right into that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I believe this goes this way. Yeah, there we go. And then you just kind of put them in there. I mean, they thought about everything. Look at that, slides in perfect. Look at that with one hand. Uh, and now they're working on their last one. So we're gonna put them all in and then I'll get back to with you guys. All right, you guys, I am done. I'm a little sweaty. I was able to do this in less than 30 minutes on my own. Look at the final result. Isn't it pretty, you guys? Look. My kids are in charge of grabbing the chairs, putting them here so I can finally watch them when they swim in our pool. So all this to say, Vinny collection is divine, you guys. Easy to put together. I was able to do it with one hand, sometimes two. My kids did help me with filling this up with water. Um, and like I said, a very easy instructions. Literally, tools come with it. I'm a woman, I could do it. If you are, you know, single or you're older or younger, it doesn't matter. You are able to do this really easily. And let's not forget, you guys, seriously. I, I know I can't say enough um, amazing things about the company, but I get a thank you card thanking me for purchasing this from them, um, which I think is just incredible. They just take the time to give you a nice little card. Uh, there's a number if you need anything. There's an email to reach them. There's a website. If you have any questions or parts missing or something is wrong or you don't know how to do something, they are there to answer questions morning and night. And so um, they are incredible. I'm excited to share my project. Oh, I can't say amazing things about it. I just cannot wait to just enjoy it. And uh, the kids are excited too to just kind of like 
be able to swim and if we want to get some shade because you all know Arizona is crazy for sunny sunny days that's all we have and now it's hitting the hundreds today it hit the hundred <laughs> and I think my AC is broken so that's another thing I'm gonna have to deal with but um, but anyways I'm just excited to share with you my little project like I said it, it really blends really well with my oasis theme here and um, I'm not gonna sit and enjoy my umbrella. Ta I'm so happy. Again, thank you so much. And um, Vinny Collection, go check them out, you guys. Don't forget, Vinny Collection, go check them out. Description below, I'll have all of the information and you will not regret it. See you later, guys. Hope you enjoyed my video. Bye.